My name is Dr. Frank Ergis from the Sinus and Allergy Wellness Center here in Scottsdale, Arizona. This time of year, it's springtime and we're seeing allergy pollen. Allergies that are bothering our nasal cavities and our airways right now would include tree pollen, grass, and weeds. Oftentimes patients are asking me if there's things that they can do outside of the traditional medical therapy to try to help to resolve their allergy symptoms. So what I found uh, when researching on the Weather Channel, I noticed that there was an article that described uh, eight different foods that can be helpful to minimize allergy reactivity and maybe help to reduce the allergy burden that we all have in these times of the year. So the first one was fatty fish. So some of this fish would include salmon, mackerel, tuna, and trout. Uh, these foods have high uh, concentrations of omega-3 fatty acids that have been shown to ease allergy inflammation inside the nasal cavity. So consider fish as far as one of your foods that may help to eliminate some allergy symptoms. Walnuts and flaxseed. Again, these also have a high amount of omega-3 fatty acids, but also selenium. And selenium actually helps to reduce allergy reactivity. The next food group would be some of the vegetables, including broccoli, cabbage, uh, onions, cauliflower, uh, some fruits, including apples and berries, and then finally green tea. Um, all of these are a good source of quercetin. Quercetin is a, uh, a chemical that's inside the, um, those food groups that helps to reduce inflammation, again, helping to uh, reduce allergy reactivity by inhibiting histamine release. So these food items can also help us feel better during allergy season. Foods with vitamin C high counts include oranges, peppers, and strawberries. Again, vitamin C supplements can also be used, but the natural food is also the best for form of this, um, uh, this chemical and uh, will actually help to reduce allergy reactivity. Garlic. Uh, I'm a big fan of garlic. Uh, my wife lets me know that if I eat too much garlic, um, but garlic also uh, helps to reduce allergy reactivity. It blocks certain chemicals in the allergy cascade. Allergy cascade is what happens when we first get exposed to an allergen from that time versus us sneezing. The chemical reactivities inside is very complex and garlic and all these other food groups can actually help to reduce that allergy reactivity, help us feel better during that season. Yogurt. Yogurt is a good source of um, natural probiotics. These help to reduce inflammation, help to um, reduce the allergy inflammatory changes that take place when there's a high immune uh, response. So again, probiotics can be helpful to help eliminate the risk for infections, but also inflammation in our airway. Turmeric. Turmeric is a spice that also is a very powerful anti-inflammatory food. So again, this food item and um, ingredient in our uh, cooking may actually help us to reduce our allergy reactivity. Then finally, magnesium. Magnesium is an element that comes in cashews, kelp, and wheat, wheat bran, and that food and that, those groups there also help to reduce allergy, helps to open up airways, especially for us asthmatics, and also helps to reduce the mucus production in our lower airways. So if you have allergies, think of these food groups and include those in your uh, daily food choices to help minimize allergy reactivity.